All right. Okay. So the next one, we've seen this one before. Uh, oh, we have a we have our own little ad playing on the YouTube video here. <clears throat> Just a second. Uh, nope. Now we have another ad playing. Come on. Oh, by the way, buy Dawn Platinum Power Wash. That's all you need to know. Okay. So this next one has Jennifer Lawrence, and we've seen a trailer for it before, but this is this is going to be um, a second one that we see. So let's check it out. We're watching the trailer for. No Hard Feelings, official Red Band trailer. Um, number two. Coming to us from Sony Pictures Entertainment, we're going to like the video. No Hard Feelings, but one summer might not be enough to get him out of his shell. Watch the Red Band trailer for No Hard Feelings, seeing in movie theaters on June 23rd. Um, Maddie thinks she's found an answer to her financial troubles when she discovers an intriguing job listing wealthy helicopter parents looking for someone to date their introverted 19-year-old son, Percy, and bring him out of his shell before he leaves for college. But awkward Percy proves to be more of a challenge than she expected, and time is running out. She has one summer to make him a man or lose it all. Now, the only... What the heck? Uh, the only thing is, is that this reminds me of... Um, Matthew McConaughey, and I think it was called, oh my god, what was it? It, it, it? There was basically a movie with a similar concept with Matthew McConaughey and that woman. Are you talking about Failure to Launch? Failure to Launch. Similar idea. They, yeah. Like, he, this guy lives with his parents, the, par the parents say, hey, we'll get you a girlfriend, she'll make a man out of you, that type of thing. Um, except this think, one, they... Yeah, he meets her on an airplane, and then, like, they hook up, and then she wakes up in the morning to his parents down in the... <laughs> are, you talking about, are you talking about Jennifer Lawrence? Or are you talking about... Oh, no. no, no. I'm talking about lunch. Oh, okay. I don't remember. It's been a little while since I've seen it, but... Uh, let's check this one out. Um, yeah. I'm going to tell you something right now. I wish that my parents had hired Jennifer Lawrence to come and date me when I was a kid. Or when I... After I graduated high school. <laughs> Not when I was a kid, but, you know. Okay. Let's keep going, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Lucky guy, that's all I'm saying. Anyway, um, one minute, 59 second trailer. Here we go. Let's check it out. And this is, I think, Jennifer Lawrence's first straight up comedy. The new house is right on the water. Come on, dog. You know how we do. GT with lime. We're not open until noon. It is noon. It's 11.57. Now what time is it? 11.56. <laughs> Lord. You need to fire her. I can't fire her. She has a disability. What? No, I don't. You don't? No. That's the reason why I hired you. <laughs> I'm an Uber driver and I don't have a car. Come on up. So this is really quiet. His parents said if I quote date their son, they'd give me a Buick Regal. You won't even rent your house out, but now you're gonna rent out your badge. You have a Roadrunner tattoo covering your entire back. I don't think you should tell anybody what to do with their body. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to teach you how to have fun. Am I allowed to be here? You can't be scared of everything. Oh, my God. Oh, fuck. Maddie Barker, your little disappearing act. That was the best thing that ever happened to me. Congratulations. Is her vagina dishwasher safe? She's a oh, real my Lord. What part of uh, Russia did they ship her from? She's Russian? No. Mm, fuck. I'm on bitches, I <laughs> how far would you go? I'm at a party. Have you seen Percy? 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 Doesn't anyone fuck anymore? I'm a oh my god. No! This is definitely for adults, okay? Oh my god. Did you fuck him? I like your oh house my a lord. Lot. It's cozy. Ooh, we should have some music. Dance party. So. Oh, you're a little heavy on my legs. You wanna switch? You wanna switch? Yeah, this is good. Oh my lord. So, I'm looking at this now, actually, and I'm, now I'm for the first time actually paying attention. I'm looking, and it says some graphic nudity and brief drug use, sexual content language. We saw the other trailer for this. It was not as explicit. I mean, like, I, you know, I know that there's an audience. I'm not, you know, and, I, and I'll probably watch this, and it'll, it'll be funny, but I didn't realize that this was as, like, they're using the F word and... Oh, all yeah. of that, a whole lot. In the first trailer, it just made it out. It made it out like it was kind of a loot, you know, because it's just like failure to launch. Like I said, except failure to launch, they alluded to some maybe some sexual things, and she's taking money for dating, but they didn't outright have people like 
making a lot of the comments that they're making here. Yeah. I don't know. What do you think? I don't think I, 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 I need to watch it. I probably need to watch the movie, but I, I will say this is that Jennifer Lawrence has a lot more potential than being a mediocre comedian because she's, she's not, she's not as funny as people think she is. Like, I, I don't think so. I think she's a much better actress in the sense of silver to linings playbook. Yeah. That like was, her, that she, she's, she's hilarious as long as she has a actor who can counteract that by mm-hmm. being, you know, somewhat sarcastic or, but if 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 she's trying to be the the funny person in the entire movie, it's not going to work. She, yeah, I, it's not. Yeah, I'm like look at, I mean, you look at like uh, what is it? The passengers, right? Where they went on mm-hmm. that star trip. Like Chris Pratt is one hundred percent way funnier than she will ever be, right? And their dynamic is, you know, it's somewhat humorous, but it's not. It still has a serious overtone. And I think that's what that's where she's really good. But if she tries to dive all in on like the seriousness, right? You get. Or if she tries to dive in all on the humor side of it, she loses her, you know, serious and stoic persona yeah. that she done so well with. Uh, so I'm, I'll just tell you the truth. Like I agree. I mean, I agree with you. I think she's a great actress. Maybe not. Maybe not the best at the comedy as much as she is playing. Yeah, like playing off another funny person. But I will. I, I just want to say, just commenting on this trailer, though, like I actually am surprised. I'm I'm disappointed in this trailer when compared to the other trailer. I think the other trailer was, did a lot better job of being funny. Here, they're really sh- like. I, I'll tell you the truth. Like, I really don't have a problem so much with if you watch like the American Pie movies or stuff like that. But even those movies, they don't just. They're not outright vulgar as much as they are alluding to sexuality and when they make jokes about stuff like because it's like teens you know what i'm saying it's always like teens trying to lose the virginity or something um and they make jokes and even they maybe will show some nudity or something but i'm talking about the actual content that they talk about is not right like oh did you f that guy oh i'm who doesn't anybody f anyone you know like okay and i'm just i'm just not gonna say you know i'm not gonna say this where it's but like this here, is below her this is below her acting ability i think and i i'm just i would not even spend any money on this person no it's just a I, remake of another it's just the same storyline you know, some other movies are just like that i think that's, yeah. that's the most stories nowadays are just repeating the same repeating thing repeating the same thing this is a repeat yeah. of other ones yeah. Yeah, I, I think, yeah, I, I I did, I think that I did see the original trailer with you, though, Other Mike. I don't know if you mm-hmm. remember, I thought it was with you, and then I believe that we had both kind of liked it, but this one, I'm disappointed. I don't know if I did that or not. It's interesting, I don't think well, so. I, I remember a different, a different trailer of this as well, and it wasn't as bad as this one. Yeah, that that one was better. The second trailer actually was not as good because well, that's what I was saying is that the first tra- it's actually this one right here where you see her and she has a guy trying to touch her and she's saying, "Oh, this is my cousin," and and then he comes up and like grabs her, you know, just kind of caresses yeah. her and she's like, "Oh, he's my second cousin," and that was funny because <laughs> it's like, oh, you know, okay, this this didn't have any of that charm. I I, I actually no. don't think so. But um, yeah. let's check out what the comments section says here. Uh, this made me laugh to the full. There's my daughter. She's awake now. I really can't believe Jennifer Lawrence hasn't done a real comedy yet. I know there are comedic elements in a lot of her roles, but this seems to be in a different level. She's going to succeed in this. I don't know. I don't know. Jennifer Lawrence is a force. She can pick and choose any project she wants, and no one can tell her what to do. Uh, It is because of the fact that I think she will be great. Okay. Yeah, I mean, other... So people in the comments do seem to like this. What the heck is this? I'm checking that out. Um, other people do seem to like this, but I, I, I'm with you guys. I would say, um, yeah, just, it, it, I, it, this is nowhere near, even if you did like it, I don't think it's anywhere near as good as the first trailer. So, yeah. I mean, when it comes, when it comes down to it, I mean, a lot of our actors, right? They're professional yeah. actors. So like, we'll never know exactly what they're best at until they do it. And yeah. then, you know, but I mean, dear for Lord, she's a great actress. She'll she'll do the best she can with whatever script she's given, but I mean, she she might it might be something worth watching, you know. But 
I think um, I think this one just just because of how much I liked the first trailer and then how much I'm now not liking this trailer. I might watch this and just do a written like watch the blog. I haven't done a blog post in a while. I'm trying to figure out a way to kind of incorporate that into my schedule of doing things. But I, I think I'll make a special effort and do a blog post about this one, um, just to see how it goes. But it's coming out June 23rd, so watch for that, guys. Okay, we've got one more, one more. So so let's finish up and then we'll we'll all head home. All right, just a second. Here we go. I'm already. Don't forget to check me out on Twitch and join the Discord where you can voice chat with me while a live stream and you won't be recorded or anything on YouTube and Twitch, so that's pretty cool. You can also find me on Facebook and Instagram. If you like to read, you can see my after action reports on my blog. And if you are interested, you can get some merch from my spring store. The links for everything are in the description below.